All right, guys. Welcome back to another review. Today we are reviewing Tombstone IPA. This one has the Chinook and Comet hops. So they only use two different hops in this uh, beer. 7.1% alcohol out of Tombstone. Nice, let's get it. All right, guys, so we have a little bit, pretty exciting announcement. We have some new upgrades to the studio. We got this mic right here. We'll see how the audio comes out. And we got a couple lights. You guys will have to let us know how the new studio is looking. But uh, yeah, I'm excited to try this beer. Tombstone cranking out the heat right always, now so always. hard. Yeah. All right, get every last drop. <laughs> every time. <laughs> Cheers. Okay, definitely, uh, it's like an opaque yellow. Okay, yeah. Hazy, can't see through it. Frothy head sitting on top. Nice head, good retention. You see any CO2? I see like moderate CO2 off the bottom. Yeah, kind of hard to see through it though, but definitely. And then the smell? Oh, peach, pineapple. Okay, I get like, uh, I get some grassy tones. Okay. Yeah. I also get with the peach pineapple, like a bubble gum. Can okay. you smell that? Bubble gum? Try it. Imagine bubble gum right now. I can't yeah, a little bit. I get kind of like, uh, I get some peach for sure, actually. So I get like a mix between peach and like some grassy, earthy tones. Okay. All right, dude. Yeah. Let's hit it. Ooh, a little pine. Oh, that's, that's probably coming from the, the Chinook. Okay. I you know they're um, a bittering hop and they usually have <clears throat> pine aromas in there. Okay. I think it's really good. I don't know. It doesn't really smell or it doesn't really taste like it smells. A little different? Yeah. Um, do, you, do you taste the pine? I get a little pine. I kind of get like the, uh, doesn't Lagunitas have some pine in it? Mm -hmm. I have like some similarities in the finish on the Lagunitas. Okay. But uh, a, lot of, a lot of West Coast will have a little bit of pine in there. Yeah, but it's kind of, I would say it's bitter for a hazy too. So today we went into uh, Tap and Bottle because uh -huh. we heard they were getting a release of tombs, tombstone cans. We were super super excited, we're probably waiting all week for this. Mm -hmm. And we walk in and they had told us Tombstone had some canning issues, so they were unable to get their shipment in today. So they so, had none, right? I didn't see one. Mm, nope, no yeah. Tombstone. Um, they could have had the sour back in there, but we weren't checking out the sours yeah, today. Yeah. So we just grabbed six beers, different kinds of beers, but luckily I still had this this uh, IPA. Uh, oh, <laughs> <laughs> this IPA in my fridge. So we're nice. trying it now. And like um, they, they did get some kegs in though. So they're filling crowlers. If you guys know what those are, those are uh, like a growler, but in a can. They can fill it up for you. Nice. So sweet. So uh, do you want to give us a quick score? Uh, yeah. Let me just taste one more. Uh, okay. I'm a, I'm, I actually like it a lot. I'm going to go with a solid 8 2. So. You know, I love hazies. Um, I'm curious to hear kind of where you're at because I know you're not, you don't like hazies as much as I do, right? No, um, I'm just like the West Coast IPAs. Yeah, yeah, for sure. And uh, one of the things, you know, I've been brewing beer for 10 years. And when I first started brewing beer, the number one goal is to come out with a clear beer. You don't want any cloudiness. You don't want haziness in there. So trying to perfect a clear beer my whole life, now I'm just drinking beers that have been unfiltered. Yeah, they're cloudy. I've they're been trying to cloudy. filter it my yeah, life. Yeah, they're all cloudy. You no, know, so I was always disappointed when I got a cloudy beer. For sure. So anyways, my score, I'm gonna give it an 8.1. Okay, um, nice. You know, I've Tombstone's had a little bit of better beers come out of them, but an 8.1 is a great score. I still really love this beer. For sure. All right, so, cheers, toss it back. Toss There's it back. another review. Make sure to subscribe on YouTube, follow on IG, and comment on IG. All right, cheers. Let us know what you guys think about the set too. All right, peace. Mm -hmm.